Good afternoon everyone, or well, no, actually it's still kind of morning. So this is Eric again, Northwest Bus Sales. Look at this, We've got the sun shining, we got some rain clouds over back beneath. The, I'll tell you what, man, Puget Sound's right over that direction. Beautiful day here in the Pacific Northwest. So let's check out this school bus, Type A school bus right here. This is a 2009 Chevrolet Collins. Collins is the bus manufacturer, it's on a Chevy chassis, van chassis. And, uh, I believe it's a 18 passenger, so you know what? We better make sure that we'll check it out when we get inside. Here we go. 2009 Chevy Collins. Uh, you can see grab bars. You come in right here. Manual entry door. Step treads are in really good shape. This bus has got a lot of life left in it. Goodness sakes, is that? Oh, for the love. Are you serious? Is that Madonna? Anyways, I'm ashamed to say I'm, I, I know that. Oh, my word. I didn't like that song in the 80s. For the love. Okay, uh, here we go. Uh, 2009 Chevy Collins. Oh, check out the mileage. This is the coolest thing about this. I actually got two of these in stock. Look at that. Mm hmm. 14,000 miles. That gum. This thing ain't even broke in. 2009, uh, you can see the manual. Uh, <clears throat> typical manual school bus entry style door right there. See that? And control panel here for uh, passenger lighting, rear heat, and mm -hmm, passenger AC. Really cool feature, interior convex mirror right here. Got a little uh, storage area above the driver's seat right here. Uh, what do we got going here? Uh-oh, what the, oh yeah, look at that, J-Box right there. Uh, as you can tell, Collins Bantam, Grand Bantam is the model of this baby. Uh, you know, the, I, I gotta say, this thing is in primo, primo shape. Super low miles, driver's seat interior upholstery is in really good shape. I'm not seeing any edge wear, I'm not seeing rips, tears, fading, nothing going on. First aid kit right down here. And typical school bus style seating. Th with seat belts though, that's pretty cool. Looks like uh, 36 inch wide seats is what I'm seeing here. And uh... As I mentioned, seat belts, typical school bus windows, but they are tinted. There's the carrier AC unit in the back, and look at that. Little in, uh, interior luggage area as well in the rear, so this would work primo. Let's see, let me count the passengers here. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 20, 2, or 23, pardon me, 20, uh, 20 plus, uh, goodness sakes, 26. But you know what? I'm only seeing two seat belts here on the. Oh, no, 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 no. Two, four, six. And then nine, 12, 15, 18, 22, 23, or goodness sakes, 22, 25 passenger. I could have swore this was an 18. Maybe. That's interesting. I wonder what I got written on the key tag here. Maybe I'm just doggone mistaken. It does say 20 there on the passenger, but you can count, you can figure it out here. So we, we, you know what? I know what I did. I just counted two per seat. I didn't realize earlier there was three seat belts. So two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18 passengers. That's where I came up with it. And that's counting two adults, but it'll also accommodate up to three kids per seat. So the floor in this baby's in primo shape. Uh, you can see dome lighting there going down the side, speakers and everything. All right. Well, let's walk around her outside right quick. Let me close this up. Here we go. Get a good look at her. Uh, check out the tire tread. Good tire tread right there. I've uh, got kind of a nice view window there for the driver. That's always nice. The body and paint, I've got to say, is looking really good on this baby. Check out the tire tread here. Good tire tread there. Get a look at the underneath a little bit. There we go. Uh, these buses, I want to say, I think we got them down in Oregon somewhere. So, if I'm not mistaken, we are seeing some scratching right here a little bit. Check it. Some slight scratches. A little bit of uh, rub. Yeah, somebody. Yeah, anyways, you can see right there. But it's. I think it's very minor. So, the body and paint, I'm going to say, is in pretty good shape. So, LED clearance lights up top. Rear emergency door. Let's check that out. There we go. Interior luggage rack, as I mentioned. There's that buzzer. I'll tell you what, that is annoying. Anyhow, button that thing up. Tinted passenger windows really gives it a nice look. Now this this is, we call them type A school buses or MFSABs, which stand for Multifunction School Activity Bus. Good tire tread there also. 
So, lots of purposes for the, I mean, daycare bus, uh, private school bus, sports team bus, you know, this, all manner of different applications, church bus, Sunday school bus, you, you know, I, you, you get my drift. So, lots of different applications on this thing, 14,000 miles. AM, FM, CD player in there. Don't know if I mentioned that. And good tire tread there. Crossover mirrors up front. LED clearance lights up top. It's got the six liter. Uh, oh, doggone it, I better double check. Make sure I'm preaching gospel here, let's see. I'm fairly certain it's either the four liter or the six, six liter Chevrolet gas. Let's check. And right, yep, you can see it right there. Six liter, V8 gas engine that'll do it 2009 chevy collins 18 passenger appreciate your time check us out online nwbus.com please call any questions 800-231-7099 thanks